Hi boys and girls, it's Mrs. Johnson again. I am here as I promised to read you the first story and today it's Clifford's Spring Cleanup. And I do have Clifford here. Clifford is listening to every word too. All right, let's see what Clifford gets into in this story. Happy spring, I'm Emily Elizabeth. At our house, it's time for spring cleaning again. Last year, the whole family worked hard, even my big red dog, Clifford. My first job was to hang some rugs out to air. Clifford wanted to help. He took a rug outside and gave it a good shaking. I guess he shook it a little too hard. Mom said, we might as well wax the living room floor as long as the rug was up. Mommy and Daddy started to move the furniture outside. When Clifford saw the couch, his eyes lit up. He used to curl up on it when he was a small puppy. Crunch! He didn't fit on it anymore. Good thing the couch was so old. Daddy was going to get a new one anyway. There was still a lot of spring cleaning to do. Clifford cleaned the windows all by himself. First he washed them, and then he dried them. Mommy didn't think Clifford's method worked very well, so we washed the windows again. Poor Daddy. He had to rake the yard. It looked as if it was going to take him all day, but not with Clifford to help. Just then, some of my friends came by. They asked me to help them clean up the vacant lot on the corner. It was their Earth Day project. Clifford did his part for Earth Day. I'm not too sure. <laughs> then we planted a beautiful garden. On the way home, Clifford and I saw some people working on another Earth Day project. Clifford gave them a hand, uh, a tail. Back at home, there was another job to do. Clifford's house needed some spring cleaning, too. He swept out his old bones and tossed out his collection of rubber toys. It made a quite a large pile. Somehow Clifford got it all into the garbage truck. Much to his surprise of the driver, now both our houses were neat and clean. It was a good day's work. I hope you, hope you all are helping your moms and dads do some spring cleaning around your house, too. I'll see you back here later. Bye.